Thanks for stopping by the studio today to get a quick overview of our specialty storage pages. So as you might already know, we make a whole line of page products called basic storage pages. And then we have what we call the specialty storage pages. The specialty storage pages are made out of a little bit heavier gauge of plastic. Um, and they serve a couple of different uh, purposes. So I'm gonna start with the least exciting, but one of our best sellers of all time. This is the side loader single. And so this is a 12 and a half by 12 and a half pocket page that's gonna hold up to 24 sheets of cardstock. So this is my 24 sheets of cardstock right here. I'm just gonna stuff it in there. I've already got one in, so it's gonna actually fit 25 sheets of cardstock for our purposes here. Then it has this little flapper do on the outside and the flapper do goes over the paper and tucks in behind the plastic and that's what's gonna hold it from dumping out, right? So side loader single, also known as the P50, you get five of them in a package and they are uh, side loading 12 and a half by 12 and a half pockets. So that's uh, especially storage page number one. Specialty storage page number two is our uh, page planner page. And this is a really cool page. Again, comes in a set of five as well. The SKU number on this is P75. And what this is, is a double-sided page that's designed to help you set up a project. That's one way to use it. So you've got three smaller pockets on the front, six by 12, eight by six, and four by six on the front. And then you've got a big 12 and a quarter by 12 and a quarter pocket on the back as well. All of them have these little locking flaps and it does come in a set of five. So you can use this to set up a project. So what I've got set up here are a bunch of Christmas pictures, the embellishments, uh, journaling notes, more embellishments, and then all the paper that might go with it. So this one little package here has 18 sheets of paper, embellishments, uh, pictures, journaling notes, all the things I need to work on these Christmas pictures. So that's one use, setting up a project. The other way to really maximize the use of this is when you buy a whole collection where you buy paper, cardstock, the accordion colored cardstock, the embellishments, the stickers, the die cuts, all the things that go together and you want to keep them together. This is a perfect storage page for those as well. So again, Project Planner comes in a set of five, also known as the P75. Moving on to number three, this is the Clearly Crafty stamp storage page. So the Clearly Crafty comes in a package of three. They're tabbed at the end, so that'll stick off the end of your scrap rack. You can see those little things floating around inside the package, and those are little Velcro dots. And when you get your uh, Clearly Crafty set, what you're gonna do is put those dots on the inside corner, and that way if you really load this up with heavy weight stuff, it's still gonna stay closed because those Velcro dots are gonna just hook together. And now you can put it into your scrap rack, into your travel pack, store it on a shelf, uh, stack it on a shelf, and you're good to go with the Clearly Crafty. And again, there's three of those in a package. Now you can also use the Clearly Crafty to store your dies. And you can do that by just putting a sheet of uh, magnet into your Clearly Crafty tray at the bottom. So this is a birthday um, dies that match these birthday stamps. I'm just going to pull the one side of the acetate off, fold it back. Then I can stick the stamps in, put the lid back on the tray. Um, so now you've got everything stored in there. You've got your stamps and your dies. Super easy, nice, easy package to work with. Clearly crafty trays. All right, number four, and one of my favorites is the Flippin' Storage Page. So Flippin' Storage Page, P81 is a single pack, and P82 are three of the Flippin' Storage Pages. So if you need to try it out and see how you like it, you can buy the single, but I know you're gonna love it, so you should buy the triple because it's gonna save you a few bucks. The Flippin' Storage Page allows you to store up to, um, well, it's got 11 pockets, right? You can put more than one thing in each pocket, but the top pockets are four by six, the bottom pockets are five by seven. So photographs in two sizes, uh, card blanks in two sizes, completed cards two sizes, but you can also use it to store whole categories 
of products. So this is all set up with um, all different kinds of travel products. So charms, embellishments, bling, uh, puffy stickers, uh, rub-ons, flat stickers, even cling stamps, red rubber cling stamps that fit that category. Everything's in there. And now when I just flip it over and close it up, I've got the little locking tab here, so I'm going to lock that down. And now I've got everything for my travel section all neat and nice and neat in the flip and storage page. Another great use for the flip and storage page is this um, embossing folders, right? Embossing folders and stencils fit great in here, so don't miss out on that. If you're somebody who uses a lot of embossing folders, this is a great way to store 11 embossing folders on one storage sheet, so don't miss out on that. So again, the flip and storage page comes in a single pack or a triple pack. P81 for the single, P82 is this SKU for the triple pack. All right, last but certainly not least in our specialty storage page presentation is the famed embossing, uh, I'm sorry, not embossing, embellishment page, right? We've been making this for years. It's a favorite, favorite, favorite of so many of our customers. And what this is, is 12 pockets on each side. It's a double-sided page. And each pocket has this little tab at the top. So that means when you fill it with your goodies, you put the locking tab down and you're gonna be able to keep everything in there. So this one has little green pieces of paper in it so you can see the pocket configuration. Here's what it would actually look like. And then I want you to notice there's also a big pocket in the middle between the two um, pocket pages. So 12 pockets on the front, 12 pockets on the back. Now this is gonna come with you're going to get three of them in a package, and then so that makes 72 pockets. Uh, you're going to get 72 little mini two by two Ziploc bags when you buy your embossing, I mean your embellishment pages. And those little tiny Ziploc bags are, of course, how you're going to corral and control all of your embellishments. So you've got all the different kinds of embellishments. Slip them into one of those little Ziploc bags and pop them into a pocket. Now it's visible, accessible, portable. You're just going to love it. Works also great for chipboard letters. So those are always kind of a struggle. I've got an entire chipboard alphabet here in just one page. And then finally, it's an awesome place to store lots of rolls of washi tape. So if you've become a washi tape junkie, this is a great tool for you to use. And then what I did is I just took a little piece of the washi tape and stuck it on the front of the pocket. So it gave me a good idea of what that roll of washi tape looks like. So two sides. I did not put the example on the back. You can see what that looks like without the example. And without the example, you get the color of the washi tape, but you really don't get a good visual on the design. So I went with the um, washi tape on the outside, and that worked really great. All right, thanks for taking a few minutes to stop by and learn all about our specialty storage pages. Feel free to call us at 866-226-1311 if you have questions. You can also reach us by email at customerservice at thescraprack.com. Thanks again.